Hello, my name is Bill and welcome to Mind Your Crypto. Today we have Luna Daily Update. We are going to see the next price targets and the potential risks that we hold. Before we pink in, do not forget to join our monthly subscription. Patreon slash Mind Your Crypto is the link you will find in the comment section and in the description box. What you will get is an automated system with 200 altcoins you will be buy and selling them. And of course, you will know exactly when and how much to buy and exactly when and how much to sell. You will also get a manual system with over 90% win ratio, personal guidance every day, educational videos to become expert in the technical analysis and hold your future in your hands, market updates, and many, many other benefits. Thank you for watching. Have a fantastic day wherever you are. Let's go real quickly into the TA for Luna first, okay? So right here for Luna against Bitcoin chart, what do we have on the daily frame? We have this selling pressure right here. This looks like a shooting star candlestick, although it doesn't have the body or covering the bottom week. You can see here the lower shadow of the candlestick. However, we had huge sell pressure. Why you should be careful right now? Burris RSI divergence will be formed for sure for Luna against Bitcoin chart. The same will happen for Luna against USDT. As you can see right here, there is a probability that we see a bearish RSI divergence. That means right now we should be focusing on these two support levels for Luna against USDT. The 80 Tether USD and the 75. Luna is going to go there no matter what Bitcoin will do. Okay. So right there, I truly believe that Luna is going towards these support levels. So you should be really, really careful on the weekly frame. We have also a very high risk. The weekly can be bearish. For example, we can get a red candlestick by the time that the week will close on Monday. Okay, so right there, be careful because I think that Luna is going to go to the next support levels that we have right now, especially the 75 Tether USD, but 80 as well. From the 75, we might be seeing some support uh, buying pressure. On the 20 day MA right now, we are for Luna, but I think we won't be able to hold the 20 day MA. I think that Luna will be going further down. The good part is that we hold it for now on, but I truly believe that we are going to lose this support level. Okay. So right there, I think that uh, for Luna, the best entry point will be probably the 75 Tether USD, maybe the 70, maybe the 0.618. We will see about that. And of course, for Luna against Bitcoin, be careful as it will start to underperform against Bitcoin chart. OK, I have warned you multiple times about Luna. The thing here is that you do not risk it. Even if we had this pump right there, you do not risk getting in right now because we have a very, very very high risk. The next support levels are the ones I'm telling you for sure right there. And it doesn't matter if Bitcoin founds a buying pressure, a good buying pressure, we go even higher. For now, for Luna, we have to see the 80 Tether USD, the 75 and the 70 Tether USD as support levels. Okay. So therefore, we need to see if we can hold these lines right there, the 70, 75 and 80 Tether USD. For now, we will just go to the 80 and we are going to see afterwards. I am just telling you that we are probably going to go down there. So you should be extremely careful. We also have the Burris RSA divergence. It is better to accumulate once this has settled, once we go further down into these lower support levels. OK, and especially right there, if we have a major correction for Luna and we go below the 20 and the 50 DMA, it is very possible to even go to the 70 Tether USD and move a little bit further down. But before that, we are going to have a swing high. Usually after a correction, we get around 75 or 80 and then we have a swing high. Then we drop down again, making a lower low, lower high pattern. But at the end of the day, we are finding a support bank pressure at the 75 Tether USD. I just want you to be careful. I respect that the fact that you are seeing this video and you're watching this video. I'm just telling you that we have a very high risk now and we had we also had a very high risk despite the fact that we went upwards all the way into the 98. OK, for Luna, we are now dropping further down and I think that we will be going further down 
for Luna, that is the case, into the 80 Tether USD, into the 75, maybe we will see about that for now, I think that 20 day MA unfortunately won't be the best uh, actually support level right here, I think that we are going to lose it, despite the fact that we had for the next, actually for the previous 8 hours we have been, it has been the best support line, I think that we are going further down from the support level and the 20 day exponential moving Average. Okay, pay attention to these targets. Of course, I will daily update if you want to write in the comments. I'm just waiting for you. And of course, thank you for watching. Do not forget to join our monthly subscription, Patreon slash Mind Your Crypto, and see you soon with many, many more videos. Bye.